and welcome to Dabbling in Journals. Today is my plan with me video. I'm using my regular size brown traveller's notebook from Traveller's Company Japan and I'll get straight into it. So I'm going to turn to my planner insert. Now last week I didn't do any planning because we had a family funeral and I just because I do this kind of cutesy planning it didn't feel appropriate. So I'll probably print off some photographs of the beautiful flowers we had at the funeral and stick those in this page. So I'm starting afresh this week and I shall just clip down my pages. Now the 17th of May is a significant day in the UK because quite a few lockdown restrictions are being eased. So I just thought I've got this really nice little wooden stamp with an image of a street cafe and I have some Versa Magic Midnight Black ink which I've just got my hands on. I have lots of other colours and I've been wanting the black for ages and I finally have it. It got to the top of my wish list. <laughs> so I'm just inking up my stamp and I thought I will pop that right at the top here to remind me of the change in lockdown restrictions oh I really like that it's quite a dark it's quite a dark black I wasn't quite sure whether or not it would be let's just have a look I just want to have a look to see if this dark black bleeds no not at all wonderful and so given that I've used some black ink I'm going to also add some washi that's black so here I've got this grid one which I think is Quite nice I quite like doing a black theme every now and again and I'm still in a bit of a black mood so I, I can never get the end of the washi okie dokie so I'm going to put bits down over my calendars because I don't choose them and I shall put a little bit here and I'm just going to go that far because I've got something in mind for that box. So I'll pop that there. And then with my coffee theme, I have some black coffee washi. I really love this one, so I don't use it very often because I don't want it to run out, <laughs> which is a bit silly really. But there we are. I'm sometimes very silly. So I put a little bit of my black coffee washi there. And then I want to just partition a bit at the bottom because I don't tend to plan anything in the evenings. I'm going to partition off a little bit that I'm going to use for meal planning. I started this a couple of weeks ago. I did have a separate meal planning journal, which I've still got in my kitchen because we use it. If anybody runs out of anything, you know, the last person to use the, I don't know, barbecue sauce or whatever we'll write it in the book so that I know to buy it so I keep that journal still in the kitchen but I thought now that we can go out and about a bit more it would be helpful for me to have my meal planning in here so that I know what time I need to be home depending on what I'm cooking so on and so forth so that's my first little bit of decoration then I'm going to take a sticker I'd like a sticker down here so let's have a look what have I got in this one all oh, right, I've got some black and white stickers in here. So let's pick one. Which one should we have? Ooh. I'm thinking I might I might choose her. I like her. Okay, let's get those out of the way. Little bits, and I'll put my sticker in. So there goes my sticker and now I've got to think about what I'm planning to do this week. So I've pulled out some of my little stickers I like using. I know that one of the things I really mustn't forget to do, so I'm going to pop that in as a to-do, is I have to order some dog food, <laughs> which is quite important. <laughs> So I really mustn't forget to do that straight after this video, perhaps would be the best time, so that you don't forget. Or my dog will be very sad. And then also today we are having somebody come to see us. We've been involved in a COVID trial, 
the one that Oxford University does. So every, well initially it was every week, then every month they come and do swabs and blood tests and they use that for their research purposes I guess and we had a letter this week saying they want to extend it for another year so presumably they want to watch the antibody response to see whether or not it's effective I, I mean I'm guessing that's what it for but I, I don't know until they come today and explain it to us and get us to sign the consent forms and I believe it's changing from a venous blood test which is obviously from a vein in your arm to a capillary one where they prick your finger which sounds more unpleasant, but never mind, you have to do your bit. So I've got my little medical sticker here, not quite sure what time they're coming, but I just put, pop that in and that will remind me that we have that and I mustn't go out until they've been, because <laughs> it wouldn't be good, would it? And then what else am I doing? Oh, on Tuesday, my sister is coming and I thought I'd use this little sticker here. Although they look like they're drinking champagne or something I mean we just have such a lovely time together I just think a little sticker of two girls laughing and being together is perfect for a visit from my sister so where should I put that I'm going to put that hmm, I'll put it at the top I think okay what else am I doing this week my daughter and I have hired a field for two hours on Wednesday lunchtime and we're going to take all the dogs to this field and do lots of training you know the kind of training that we can do where we need lots of space so I'll put my little dog sticker there and do I have anything else planned at the moment I do have to make sure that I'm in for my grocery delivery on Friday morning Oh, I'm still having it delivered online because it's really convenient. Well, I mean, I order online and then it gets delivered. And that comes really early in the morning, so I'll pop that in for Friday. I want to pop a coffee sticker in because it will go with my sort of coffee theme and remind me that sadly my sister and I will be drinking coffee. <laughs> it's not wine. First thing in the morning on a Tuesday. I'm sure I've got some coffee. Yeah, I've got some coffee stickers in here. So, which one shall I pick? Life is too short for bad coffee. That's a good one. Let's pop that one in. Okay. And I need to write in a few things, as always. I know that um, that's going to be 12.30. Don't need a time for that, don't need a time for that. On Wednesday, my son has his piano. Let's pop that in. I need to get some like musical stickers if I can find some. So we have piano on Wednesday, we have tap on Thursday, and we have musical theatre on Friday. I don't think swimming lessons have started again yet. We have had a message that karate lessons are starting again soon, but I'm not sure if that's this week, so I can't pop that in yet. Do you want to do my meal planning? So tonight we're going to do a risotto. My boys love risotto. And then tomorrow we have dog training, agility. I haven't written that in, so I have to just remember to check whether or not that's on. Uh, I never put it in, the, I mean, these are dated, but uh, not dated, these are timed slots, but I don't really use them like that. So I'm thinking next year I am gonna change back to the layout of planner where you have the days and then the notes because I'm not using this in the way that it's intended. Though I'm still enjoying it, it's fine. So because we've got agility, I need something that I can cook before I go so that it's ready for when we get back. So I think I'm gonna do Thai curry noodles and then Wednesday I think I will do chicken wraps and Thursday I'm going to do carbonara pasta carbonara with some garlic bread maybe and salad 
I will remember that. Okay, and then obviously I do plan my next lot of meals when I do my shopping Thursday evening to be delivered Friday. So I'll write those in later. Okay. I had to pause then as my uh, dog wanted to go out. So where was I? So I was writing in the things that I need to do for the week. Haven't decided what we're doing this weekend yet. It may or may not fill up. We may decide that we're not going to do very much at all. Now I've saved this space at the bottom because I want to put my weekly reflection in here. In previous weeks, I was writing it sort of sideways. But now that I'm doing meal planning, I thought, well, I'll write my weekly reflection here. And this morning, the card that I pulled to inspire my weekly reflection was this one. And it says on it, responding, not reacting. The only control we have is in how we respond to the hand we are dealt. Which I thought was really interesting. So I looked it up in the book and it was talking about how the message of the card is to remain in your self-control and therefore integrity as you assert yourself with respect and consideration to all parties involved. If a person or circumstance cannot or will not meet you halfway, empower yourself by walking away. As you leave, feel your emotions and empathise with yourself. Let any uncomfortable emotion be acknowledged and energetically released in a safe space through your preferred form of movement. Take what is to be learnt from the uncomfortable experience and use it to assist you in going forward positively. I mean, sometimes it really freaks me out how appropriate some of these cards that I randomly select can be because I have had a difficult experience that I wasn't quite sure how to respond or react to. And I will be thinking about that this week. I don't want to share it because it involves other people and that's not fair. So I am going to put for my reflection... The only control we have is in how we respond to the hand we are dealt. Really pretty card as well. You can see, I'll zoom in, you've got somebody going through a difficult experience and somebody else comforting them and providing support. But we do have to remember that we can't control everything and all we can control is how we behave. We can't control how other people behave. We just have to respond to it appropriately. So I really like that card. So that was a bit of a digression from my planning, but I do always put my weekly reflection into my planner. Okay, so I've got my appointments in. I've done some decoration. I've got my meals written down. I'll have a think about what I want to do over the weekend. And I think that is all I want to do in this week's plan with me. I hope that you found some of it interesting or inspiring in some way. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Bye.